A new report from the Oregon Employment Department projects the Rogue Valley will add 13,000 jobs between 2021 and 2031. That's an 11 percent increase, which one local economist, Guy Tower, says is down from the previous decade. Slightly slower than the last 10 years. And basically just because um, of the uh, aging boom, baby boomers, a little bit slower population growth, a little bit slower expected uh, population growth of the folks in the prime working age years. He says the Rogue Valley still hasn't recovered all the jobs lost from the pandemic, which affected the projections as well. The largest increase in jobs is expected to come in the private educational and health services industry, with leisure and hospitality not far behind. Compared to the rest of the state, Jackson and Josephine counties are expected to lag slightly behind, but remain higher than Coos, Curry, and Klamath counties. They were expected to be a little bit slower than the, the Bend area and a little bit slower than the Portland area. So um, overall statewide is expected to grow about 13%, and we're just slightly um, slower growth in the Rogue Valley than uh, uh, the overall statewide trend, which is really driven by uh, the Portland area a lot. That's usually the case with economics in the state. In the short term, though, the Rogue Valley lost a combined 1,500 jobs in January. Tower says this is normal after the holidays as retail payroll shrinks. Uh, this time of the year, um, we, we always uh, have an uptick. Uh, like in December and November, uh, we see an uptick in retail trade jobs. And then, of course, some of those um, go away after the holidays.